So we're here at the Isorg, and uh, who are you? So I'm Christoph Premond, I'm working for Isorg. And uh, Isorg is uh, designing some uh, photodiodes. And uh, these photodiodes are on PET substrate, on plastic substrates. And we can uh, design uh, whatever shape of photodiodes. And they are still flexible. And you can have some annular shape or rectangular shape as you want. So, so what does it mean what you just said? The, the photo, photo, what do you say? This is a photo diode. This is a sensitive device for photo detection. It's like a camera. Yeah, uh, it's uh, yes. If you have many of them, you can have pixels, and then yes, you can have a camera. So, how many pixels are coming out of this kind of shape? What do you mean, there are many of them? Okay, here you have only photo diodes. If you look at the other sensors over there, yeah. you will have uh, the pixel area. And pixel over here, array. you are not touching the device. No, here, uh, using optics, you can have a, a slider without any touch. Okay, basically, it's the same function as the touch devices, yeah. except that you can scratch, you can do whatever you want, you can use them with gloves or with, uh, with uh, uh, finger, uh, wet fingers, I think we will still work. Alright, cool, let's check the other one, the other demo you have right here. So, uh, what are we looking at here? This one is a flexible array. This is a flexible array, an image sensor. If it's here, it will be good. This one is a large one. This device is 300 dpi. It is a digital biometric computation. Here you have a demo in which you can have a four finger application. Okay. Four finger. Four finger application. So that's uh, for the so security at the airport. This is the, the card control. of our business developer. Mm -hmm. Immigration so, uh, you probably should, uh, should get in touch with us uh, if you have uh, all the uh, right. 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 uh, Also samples. for police. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and you partner with FlexEnable? You, you maybe, yes. probably uh, so ask us what part? Uh, some samples for evaluation. OTFT by plane, the transistor. And ISOG is providing the photo diet. And you're based in France, right? Yes, we are. And uh, what's the status of this technology? How many people are using it? Are you, sh are you shipping uh, no, a lot but, or yeah. is it... What no, is the basically at the moment we are building a new manufacturing, a new factory. Okay. So the R&D center is located in Grenoble here. And our factory will be located in Limoges. The goal is to get the building ready by end of this year. We are transferring the process and either should be able to get in production by Q3 next year. And uh, production, that means mass production? That means uh, yes, you're going to ship millions of these? Yeah, yes. What's the interest so far for this kind of stuff? Uh, uh, like uh, a lot of companies are uh, considering using this somehow? Basically, we have two, two domain of application. We have a logistic application uh, where we are using uh, discrete photodiodes, but a large number of them. Or we have some biometric application like the fingerprint application here. We are working with uh, in close collaboration with Flexenable to provide some pixel array. Right. And the smaller ones, what could they be used for? The smaller one is only used uh, because uh, it's easier to test or to perform some aging, some reliability analysis on this one. Uh, this is why we have a small form factor and we have a large one for the four finger application. And it's flexible and uh, durable? And yes, basically we, we are performing all the aging uh, tests at the moment. And uh, so we have, some of them are running more than 2,000 2, hours, 24 hours a day. And they are still alive and in good shape. And not losing, uh, not losing any performance? We are losing slightly some percentage of sensitivity at the early beginning uh, of the sensor. Just after manufacturing, like a panel phase. But then after that, it is very steady. Very steady. 